It is 2012, and nobody is more excited about that than me, Mr. Beefy Goodness Vance Nevada, the most successful champion in all-star wrestling history. And we're kicking that off in a big way on Friday night, January 13th in Cloverdale at the fairgrounds because All-Star Wrestling has lined up a challenger in former WWE superstar Gangrel. And it is absolutely no surprise to me how they arrived at this challenger. You see, over the last two years, they have thrown all the best at me in hopes of relieving this stranglehold that I have on this championship. Let's take a look at who they've given me. Well, first of all, there was Disco Fury. Absolutely. Fabulous amateur wrestler, internationally celebrated in England and Japan. Had a tremendous career on the West Coast. But let's face facts, Disco. The most tough battle that you've had in the last two years has been with your own receding hairline. And who is next? Of course, Kyle Sebastian, the future legend. Let me tell you something, kid. Not one time ever in my life has somebody given me an award for something that I haven't accomplished yet. Uh-uh. Everything I've ever gotten, I've earned with my own blood, sweat, and tears, and you see that on your screen right now. So All-Star Wrestling is left scratching their heads. What are we going to do about this problem that is Vance Nevada? We need to think outside the box. No, in fact, we need to think outside of this realm. Let's find ourselves a monster to take down Vance Nevada. Let's get ourselves a wolfman. No, even better, let's get a vampire. So on Friday the 13th, I go into the Cloverdale Fairgrounds to take on a vampire, Gangrel. Now Gangrel, sir, certainly I'm very well aware of your accomplishments and your achievements around the world throughout your career. And I'm not looking past you, I'm looking through you. And that is a very different thing. Because for the fans on the West Coast, you haven't seen me live in a long, long time. And we're going to get reacquainted in a big way. Because 2012, I'm going to continue to dominate and continue to be the most successful champion that you've ever seen. Friday, January 13th in Cloverdale is gonna be a night that you don't wanna miss.